Hello, hello, and oh boy, it's the last spell, and it's the last day, it's the last night. Uh, uh, <laughs> I forgot to, uh, wait, I saw your friend changing. I, I forgot to do this. Pwah, I see that pesky twat. Wow, we're using big words. I bet she is still as excruciatingly boring as ever, isn't she? Don't listen to her ramblings and feed me more essence. You are doing great, dear. Okay, well, mm, oh, cool. We don't have enough, so it doesn't matter. Nothing matters. Nothing matters. Um. Yeah, here we go. Uh, uh here we go. Here we go. Come here, freaks. On the left side there, didn't, ex didn't see that coming. Okay, I didn't see that coming. A lone dryad. There's probably more in the brush bushes. Be careful. Be cautious. Uh, yeah, there's only one of her. Whoa, never mind. I thought that there was a, like, the delay was over. But then again, we didn't have any monsters yet. So I really should have uh, seen this coming. We've got mushroom lads. Mushroom, mushroom lads. Do these guys uh, heal units, I wonder? Ugh. And of course, our crossbow person is... I, I was like, I'll put them there. They'll be close to the teleporter, right? Wrong. Wrong. Ugh. Wrong. So now they are as far away from the boss as basically possible. It's almost worth having them go to the other teleporter. Actually, there's enough stuff in the way that it's probably not true. Um, how much does this punch do? 60 damage? We could go over here and then punch this business. Yeah. Cool. And uh, maybe we can even reach them? Wouldn't that be convenient? No. No! What is that? Hatchery. Well, we can kill that. Nice. Okay. Putri putrified Dryad. I have to assume there's going to be at least two more of these. Kind of just want to, like, leave all of this business over here. Like, it just doesn't matter. And then just come over here and, and do some damage to this thing. Okay, so I, it has to be targeted in the center? No, it's it's a two by two. Okay. Um, does it, it doesn't have armor, right? No armor. It does have some resistance. Does it have dodge? It doesn't have dodge, I don't think. So I think I'm just okay to keep, like hit it as hard as I can. Hitting it with uh, my basic attack after it's poisoned will actually do more damage than if I hit it with more poison. Should have done the contagion. For Why do I always forget this very simple like premise? And actually we will do the most damage with our hand crossbow person. Because we get to do a full six multi-hits per turn. So the good news is we are going to kill this thing this turn. May as well attack some other things while we're at it. Okay, it's the, you know, something. It's this is something now the problem is <laughs> The problem is is you know, what's gonna happen, right? Right, uh We don't know where the next one is spawning So that tells me that this is a boss that is gonna be difficult in in mostly because we don't know where they appear Because they could appear anywhere. Does this thing have movement? No, it doesn't it just sprays Honestly, I'm kind of fine with that Unless I guess, like, we should kill it for sure, but 
I think I'm okay with it existing for now. I'm like, don't get me wrong. I, I know I'm taking like a lot of chances here and I'm, I'm being kind of lackadaisical about this. It's, it's mostly because I'm still, I'm gauging expectations or not ga expectations so much as like, I'm trying to figure out how stuff works. So I think the, the main gimmick of this boss is probably that we don't know where it appears. I think that's the main problem with it. What is this focus? It gives us extra action points. That's, I don't know what I when I got that, but that's pretty decent. Okay, that's a pretty good set of stuns. Could do a little bit of damage here if we want. Wondering if it... Nah, I don't know. This uses up mana that we probably shouldn't burn. So let's just go ahead and use a brace. And kind of call it a day. Oh, I guess we'll kill this blocker. At the very least. And then kill this guy in the back that isn't stunned. Never mind. He's a little bit chunkier than I expected. Uh, we've got a good setup here for these boomers. Is this a, is this a new dude in the back here? Twisted. He looks like a mage. I think he's a, I think he's a mage. That's kind of interesting. Like one of the mages working on the spell. Wow, he just like straight up can't see that guy. Okay. Uh, I'll just like hit this guy hard. I know there's some dudes on the I was hoping I wouldn't kill him actually My goal was actually not to kill him Florian I'm just gonna move you closer to that teleporter That teleporter is really ill placed because I can't see it at all Um, we, What could we do for our lad? Here Man, this is, just, this is just like some we can we can poison that hunter. That's not bad Okay, let's just like let him have armor Keon, uh, it would be really good if we could have you do anything but no you're stuck where you are fine Uh, Yeah could be better. There's the next Dryad. Okay, so yeah, as I say, the, 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 the gimmick here is that we don't know where they're going to pop up. Oh, there's two of them now, actually. Now there are two of them. Oh, I was going to say, are there three of them? Because that would just be a huge bummer. I won't lie. Lots of these mushroom lads. Uh oh, what is that? Seed mortar. Okay, well, one of those seed mortars is no more. Um, as precarious as it is, I, I honestly think that our best bet is to just like ignore the enemies and go straight for the boss. So those mushrooms not only buff, but they also dispel. That's a problem. We can't really let them do their do whatever they want. This one is like really far out there. Um, I'm a little bit worried about that. Where's our okay? So our, our crossbowmen. There's no way that they can reach anything, basically. So we may as well have them kill units this turn. We might actually have our, um, well, I was going to say we could possibly have our, our, uh, spear dude hit someone. Now, do they have the move that lets them gain movement back? When the hero has three or less current movement points and attacks, they restore one movement point. Yeah. So they have nine movement. Therefore, if they moved over here, 
they should be able to restore some stuff back. Yeah, this is actually not bad. Um, and in fact, they gained some more movement, so we could come over here and then hit something else. And they gained some more movement, and now we can come right up to them. I don't know if there's a benefit to going right up to it. Stunning it wouldn't be a terrible idea. Um, just like hitting it as hard as possible is probably the thing to do. And let's take a couple of these. Um, we could try and stun it. Why not? What's the stun resistance? A thousand percent! Dude, you just really went for it, huh? You just really, really wanted this thing to be stun resistant. Seems unfair, honestly. Just gonna come over there. Um, yeah, there's no way we can reach it with basically anyone else. Our crossbowman um, might be better off moving to the bottom corner rather than the top. Can actually reach the teleporter and use it. Unfortunately, they're not going to be able to gain any damage from this. I kind of almost, well, see, there's two dudes next to it, so I need to, like, take care of them first. Let's try this. If it kills the other two, that'd be great. It missed. Like, come on. Come on. Uh, there's really no point in not just, like, hitting this guy as hard as possible. As it is, they're gonna get to, both of these lads are gonna get to live for a whole turn, which is just like really not good. Actually, I might be able to kill both these guys and gain some damage. Yes, well, I killed one at the very least. I'm gonna use their potion of stability. I really don't know what these guys are capable of. So if they can stun, for instance, using that potion of stability would be ideal. Um. Yeah, I'm a little bit concerned about this boomer situation here. They have extra move points given to them by something. I don't know what. This twisted is also a problem, but I really feel like I just need to, I don't know, move. I, I, I kind of think that our ballistas could take out the boomer, maybe, question mark. If I hit them with a tight volley, it would just remove their movement bo bonus, but I don't think that that would actually help I really think that I ought to just like move over here and hit the boss as much as possible. Probably should have done that in the first place, although I can't really hit anything. Like, I guess if I used my movement potions, or at least one movement potion, I could have done something. Like, I could have killed those two guys and then our crossbow person would have gotten some extra damage in. There is that. So, uh, you know, that's that's my bad. I can't think of everything. Sounds like I'm almost blaming the viewer, but I'm not, I promise. I could have, yeah. Uh, oops. Did you see that? I sure did. Um, so we could do 232. I think that that would be worth more than a Reign of Arrows. I don't know if hitting the same unit with multiple tiles of the Reign of Arrows means doing more damage. Uh, and I guess I'm gonna brace, which is really unfortunate. Thomas. Thomas, I fear for you. Um, a little bit, anyway. See if we can't do some damage with the blaze. That was not as much as we'd, as, as you'd hope. Actually, that's kind of great, because the thing is, is that now we get to keep our... Can I? I can't reach that guy at all. This stupid blocker. I mean, I guess that's their point, right? The, the whole point of them is that they can block you. Let's just go ahead and freaking laser beam these guys. Gone ahead and upset Thomas.
And I want to hit this boomer as much as I can. Ugh, these trees are a real problem. Yeah, I kind of didn't want to kill the boomer, to be honest, but it's fine. Joanna, oh, Joanna, you've, you've got, a, got a lot of stuff over here, don't you? Kind of, kind of, let's just like back up a little bit and try a Reign of Arrows, see where that gets us. Not bad. Um, I actually think that uh, this is a better Druid Staff situation than it is a Scepter situation. Certainly, we're going to be able to do some, some work. I guess I could move her over. She could be hitting the other boss. She could have probably hit the other boss. Yeah, I made... I, that's an error on my part. Let's just move her over now, because she's still got... She's still got stuff to do. What? Oh, man. God damn it. Okay. It's fine. We'll just move her over. Can she reach it? Yes, she can. Let's poison it. Yes, it is worth doing that because then she gets opportunism. Just hit it as hard as she can. Okay, it's not dead, but it will die on the next turn. Uh, I don't know where to put our druid, to be honest. Uh, I mean, I, I guess if I move him over here, they have three movement left. They'd have two movement left. I guess it's worth it. I don't think it is, to be honest. No, none of that helps. Oh, oh cool. Cool. Uh, apparently using the teleporter counts as an action, not a movement. Well, he can use an action point to gain some more movement. I apparently gave them run. Which, you know, not a, not a terrible idea on my part. I want them to be able to hit this Dryad with their main action because they'll have better opportunism. Not bad. Not bad damage, honestly. It's a real shame we couldn't kill it. It's a real darn shame. I really wish I could kill this guy, this uh, mushroom lad. Let's just use our quick reload and kill some other stuff. <laughs> I keep trying to kill that one mushroom lad and it keeps not letting me. <laughs> Okay, uh, this next turn will kind of make or break how things go because I don't know what those dryads do Okay, we have another one. They just kind of have no respect for turn order We have a fourth one. All right. What did they do on it? How many dryads are in this damn forest? There's no end to it. I agree Wait, what? Okay, yeah, uh, I figured we weren't done so they they debuff They've debuffed and uh, are one of our heroes with negative two actions. If that's the most they do, I'm honestly not too worried. Tons of mushroom lads appearing. Oh, God, it's it sucks seeing that, honestly. Those traps are doing some good work. As are the ballistas. Now that boomer there is going to 100% completely destroy my wall, unfortunately. We also have a boomer here to, to worry about. One hundred percent armor. Did I just see that? There goes three of our ballistas. I could have probably done something about that. I, I definitely probably could have. 
So this boomer here uh, gives me a cause for concern. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and hit this thing three times. Okay, that's good. And we're going to run away. And actually, I can't run far enough away, so I might have to actually just like commit to killing this boomer so that we don't lose a hero. That gave us some more movement, actually. So that's that might mean we don't have to commit, which is good. OK, um, let's start with a reign of I feel like our crossbow person has not hit. OK, they did hit this person, this this uh, this guy. Let's kill this thing. Wow, our damage is so bad. When we don't have that bonus. Can we, can we kill this dryad? Did we seriously miss it? Okay, well, we managed to kill it, and she has something over here to, to shoot at, so that's good. Kind of... I need to hit that boomer. Let's try this. Oh, my God. Wow. Wow. Did it just like spread that immunity to the other thing? Okay, we need to get over there and start hitting the next boss. The next dryad. Can I seriously not hit it because of the trees? Wow, I hate that. I hate that a lot, actually. Can we get... If we get like go as far as we possibly can can i still not hit it wow those trees are really annoying <laughs> my god okay well you know what how about we go the other way there's uh there's plenty of things to shoot at over here Oh, man. Why did I do that? There was a teleporter there. I actually probably could have moved over there without having to spend much of anything. Uh, making, making mistakes. Okay, well, that's, that's something. Uh... So we could move over here. I don't think that this doing this would be as worthwhile, to be honest, because I can probably just move over and start shooting it. In fact, I can move all the way over and then start hitting it with heavy bolts. Uh, never mind, actually. It's not super clear where these things begin and end. So like I'm even though it looks like I should be able to hit it, I can't. That's fine. We're just going to shoot it. I don't get any of my bonuses, but we're just going to shoot it. And I'm going to go ahead and well, I thought that we could kill whatever, whatever. We'll just we'll just kill some stuff. Uh, we still have Potion of Stability. I don't know if we're going to get to keep that. I think we will. Our Druid over here is in Dire Straits, but I think we can move him over here and hit, hit this boss. Really? Really the lamppost? Man. Man, they really just, like, insisted on this level being the most annoying. God damn. <laughs> Okay. Uh, all right. We want to poison the boss. That should have propagated, but it didn't. Okay. Uh, we just want to hit it. We want to hit it as hard as we can. Just hit the boss. Okay. Uh, you over there. You're in a very bad spot, actually. What can you do? Well, you've got a rain of arrows. 
kind of want to just like get you over away from there let's start with a rain of arrows there's a probably a good rain of arrows here somewhere this isn't a bad one yeah let's do that nice not terrible um kind of want to hit him hit, hit her with the uh the scepter because i think it'll do the most damage with the momentum out of range huh yeah that was actually really good um honestly wind walk wouldn't be a terrible idea not just for the movement but also for the dodge bonus and we're just gonna hit it if i can kill it with the scepter that would be amazing. I don't think I'm going to be able to hit it with the scepter. Or kill it. Actually, you know, now that I think about it, um, probably centipedes would have been better because it's got opportunism. There we go. Yeah, I kind of messed up there, but we killed it. So I, I realized in time the error I was making. Let's do focus. Reason being, there's a really good uh, poison propagation there. That's not bad not not ter terrible kind of want to just like back her up because well she doesn't have get the bonus from uh yeah she doesn't get the bonus from being next to, to items or you know objects on the map but um still getting backing her up a little bit wouldn't be a terrible idea now um thomas thomas we could get you to the other dryad, I think. I think we could just barely do it. Because you have got pretty good range. Oh, god damn it. God damn it, Thomas. Okay, well, let's just get you to kill some stuff. I just like I should kill this twisted thing whatever it is because I, I don't like the idea of it like I haven't seen what it's capable of yet and it is also kind of a tank so actually Thomas not reaching the boss is maybe a good thing in some ways Um, okay, that guy, that guy, nice. Okay, um, honestly could do worse. I am concerned, but we'll see. We're going to have two more dryads on the field. No question about that. Traps are doing okay. Blisters are okay. Could be better. I'm honestly like the, the one thing that the ballistas are not going to take out ever are the boomers and the boomers are going to take out the ballistas. Miss. Nice. A little bit of luck. So we've got another twisted out there. Luckily, we don't have any um, beefy dudes. I like I, there's make no mistake. Stuff sucks right now, but the beefy dudes would just like do a lot to make things really bad. The uh, immunity is really bad from the mushrooms because like not being able to poison stuff is is no bueno. OK, we definitely need to do something about this. Where is everyone? There's no way that that... Okay, so, like, you can see we have basically made no progress on the boss. So, this is only the beginning. This dryad is, like... This dryad business is, like, that's... This is just a taste of what is to come, unfortunately. Um, I definitely need to focus on killing this boomer because they are just going to... 100 percent 
destroy everything over here. Maybe we can do some more stuff over here. I feel like I'm kind of on a roll. There's no Lancers, fortunately. These guys all have kind of immunity. But fortunately, it doesn't stop propagation. That guy had immunity and he still got stunned, which is interesting. And actually, we can we can back up. So that's not a terrible set of moves. Um, we're definitely going to move our crossbow person over here. I'm wondering, can we do some heavy bolts? E yes. Kind of up in the air, but I think so, yeah. Yeah, we really don't have any of our bonuses right now. Um, I kind of want to just like take out a couple of these guys. It's not a good idea. Like they would be best hitting the dryad, make no mistake. Okay, just like miss every shot on that one winged dude. That That's certainly gonna help. Oh my God. That one winged dude is, is like dodged everything. Um, I think a blaze over here wouldn't be a terrible idea. Missed. Missed the one dude. Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, it's not good. It's not good. We're definitely going to need someone over here. Someone else over here. If we want to kill this thing this turn. And I definitely think we should. Okay, let's teleport them over here. I think the Dryad is going to be able to make it. God, it's probably just barely, yep. Just barely not enough. So they do have extra movement, which is saving my butt right now. Um, we want to poison them and then uh, hit them with the centipedes. Oh God. So we need to dedicate like one more person over here. Uh, if I could only now, well, this isn't a terrible idea. If only I could hit them. If I could hit them, what is the range on this? It's it's just barely not far enough. Um, you don't have extra move. Well, you do have extra movement. Okay, let's get you over there. This is dumb. This is stupid. This is bad. This is a bad idea. But we're gonna we're gonna commit. Okay. So something tells me that is only the first phase. And in fact, we have to kill like a hundred more of those. Something like that. Uh hope is fading. Like, look at all the stuff we have to kill. It's just, like, not a joke. I'm just, like, killing as much as I can, and I'm getting close, as close to the teleporter as I can, because I 100% they're going to need to to be just near a teleporter. Joanna, you still have tons of stuff you can do. Um, huh. Oh my god. You have no movement to speak of. All right, she has a propagation diagonal. Forgot about that. Okay, um...
race, I guess. This is gonna be bad because we don't know what comes next. Just, just more. Three. This time, three of them. Uh, okay. All right. Yeah, just more. Okay, more. Sure. This is uh, where I start to question things a little bit. Like, how in the world am I supposed to, you know, fend against this? Traps doing some work, which is good. If they could kill anything, that would be really nice. Like, the ballistas, at least they kill, you know? We are poisoned. One of us is poisoned anyway. Um, I, I keep hoping that this up here is going to update soon. Because if we're not even like halfway through this boss, then I don't even think I want to try. <laughs> like, it, that's just really tedious. Okay, I, I'm gonna go ahead and skip through that because I'm, I'm sick and tired of seeing it. Um, I don't know what to do for us here. What are these? Okay, all right, we're, we're two thirds through. Okay, so hopefully that means if we kill these three dryads, then we're in the last phase, but I, I say hopefully, like, as if there is any hope at all. Cause come on. What in the world are we doing here? This is just like actually ridiculous. Um Well we've got enough lads over here. We should be able to kill this one dude. This this one. Putrefied dryad. Let's see what we can do with our crossbow. Uh, oh my god, really? So you have to kill the stuff around them. Uh, I, I don't know. I'm getting that feeling. You know the feeling? You know that feeling you get when you think that it's just absolutely pointless that feeling these we, i think these are actually worthy of an acid spray because they've got a lot of armor they are they are actually poisoned now so we can hit them with our best shot if we could kill it i'd have some hope Just, just carry on, you wayward son. Go. Hit it as hard as you can. We kind of wasted that last one, but that's fine. I really didn't want to take a chance that we, like, I don't know, somehow miss or something. Uh, and now the this guy is, like, 100% in the way, like, in danger of getting boomed. Uh, the the both of them are actually let's go ahead and use a health potion um see if we can't kill that one boomer probably should have hit them with a heavy bolt to begin with do we have anything left 
We kind of do, actually. There we go. That's not terrible. I'm going to reload. Let's just keep going. Keep keep doing it. Uh, spread some poison. Why not? Unfortunately, this boomer can actually reach me. I'm going to increase our dodge. I Will it help? I don't know if it helps against an explosion, but you never know. Um... And we're just going to move back towards that teleporter because we need everyone to make their way across town. Uh, I, I think that Spear Guy is going to die. I don't think that there's any help or hope for Spear Guy. I mean, that's something. If it could stun this guy, it'd be something else. Hey, that's not bad. Uh, do we, like, make our way over there and risk killing this guy? Sure. Sure. Joanna. Joanna, you can actually go and do something else if you want. Hey, actually, um, Patience. Patience can do some stuff. Patience has got some pretty good um, footing here. Not bad. Oh, except I, I didn't kill the one thing that was blocking my way. Good. Good stuff. Um, yeah, I think I just need to like hit it as hard as I can. Can I hit it with power shots? Yes. Oh, the one power shot I had. Yes. Actually, can let's reload and then hit her with more power shots. And why not another rain of arrows? Booyah. Okay, Scepter Lad, you are needed over here. I don't think you can reach, not with anything, um, with a scepter, but you can poison them, maybe? Yes. Let's go ahead and do that and then hit them with some centipedes. Not bad, actually. I'm going to hit them with acid spray because they're going to regenerate armor. And this will make it so that their next turn, they have less armor. We're running out of mana on top of everything else. Yeah, here comes some more dryads. Are they going to spawn a third one? I, I think I'm done with this game. <laughs> I, it's just like super tedious. That's so tedious. Like, on top of the fact that there's just like a ridiculous number of things descending upon us, you want me to kill three of these absolute damage sponges? I just don't... I don't see it. I don't see it. I think this is the end. <laughs> the game should... The series should have ended in Lakeburg. <laughs> that should have been my red flag moment. Oh, God. <laughs> Look how much uh, panic we're going to generate this turn. Oh, cool. Cool. The mage dude just has laser beam. Oh, and he killed someone. Who'd he kill? 
someone important, I bet. Um, here's, here's, here are my thoughts. Um, even if, like, I don't know if, uh, there's another phase after this. But even if this was the last phase of the boss, I still think that I would be fatigued out of existence. Like, it just feels like... Um, malice at this point. It doesn't feel like fun. Like, this doesn't feel fun. It feels malicious. And uh, I, I, I'm not a fan. I'm going to try my best. Um, that's really all I can do. But yeah. If we that was a crit, that's not bad. They're still poisoned. We can kill them. And um, I guess we can try and move over and start hitting this one over here. It might be that this is the last phase, like if I can kill these what's on the field right now. God, there's four of them. There's four of them. After I killed one. That means there were five of them. <laughs> ah, what the hell? So who died over here? Oh, this is my crossbow girl. I mean, wow, these guys are almost dead too, huh? Both of them. But these guys have four health left. Wow. Wow, bud. Oh, that's cool. Um, how much damage does this do? I don't have line of sight, huh? Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. I I don't know what I'm doing. Can we hit her? Nope. So, uh, hey, uh, just, just a, just a small nitpick here. As long as the hero didn't kill anything this turn. Plus two multi hits. I didn't kill anything. These, these monoliths are not a creature. Just, you know, I'm just nitpicking, I know, but like, I'm just saying. You know, that was, that was kind of an unnecessary extra bit of cruelty oh my god all right well um i mean we can potion up a lot a lot of do good that'll do um if i had six multi hits per hit i still don't think i would have killed this thing but, you know. All right, so they're going to die now. In fact, they're both in range of this guy to do his laser beam attack again. So they're dead for sure. Um, ironically, uh, our spear guy here is going to do really well. Yeah, these guys have like infinity uh, stun resistance. So um, forget about forget forget about, uh, you know, trying to stun them.
not sure where I'm going from here, to be honest. I guess. I. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Can't even move over there because there's an enemy standing on the teleporter. I could move here, but that's like the worst spot of all time. Uh. Yeah, like the teleporters are actually becoming unhelpful because there's just so many enemies near them. Um, I don't know. I mean, I also were those things cost mana because of course they do. So I yeah, I'm, I'm yeah, this is this is this is done. We're going to watch all of my heroes die this turn, and then we're going to uh, sing a song to remember the series and what we what we enjoyed about it and what we, you know, it's it's good. This is a, a good send off, you know, good way to, to, to die on a boss. Like, this is the thing, like I always say, but you know what? Here's the thing, right? I'm wrong. I was I, I've always said that not knowing what to expect is the worst thing about the boss. That's not the case anymore. In this case, the boss just sucks and there's nothing you can, there's nothing that would really change anything. Like I, I would, I think I did pretty well, actually. I built a bunch of teleporters and the teleporters should be like the Achilles heel against this boss since the gimmick is, we don't know where they're going to appear, right? That's the gimmick. They, we don't know where they're going to appear, but no, actually the worst part about this boss is not the fact that we don't know where they're going to appear. It's that it just sucks. It just sucks because there's like infinity of them and like they resist everything. Did our lads over there survive? We'll see. I'm going to, I'm going to fast forward. Nope. Someone over there died. I don't know who died over there, but someone important, I'm sure. There is four of them left. This one dies of poison. If I could... No, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I'm... Even, oh, I don't know what I'm thinking. There's, there, there ain't no way. And also, these guys have armor now. So, like, on top of everything else, you have to contend with the fact that they are going to regenerate all of their armor every turn uh oh we can actually fatality that guy that's kind of nice we'll move back and inertia if that had killed that guy that's the only thing that would have given me any kind of hope at all like i don't know if we survive one more round i could kill this guy this guy's gonna die from poison so you know uh there's something there but <laughs> they're right on my doorstep the one nice thing is i don't think that they can kill my dudes in the next turn like if the wall i had put around them was down then yeah but like i'm just gonna let spear dude try and take that guy out maybe that's a mistake but i don't think i can afford like, if I actually want to try and make an attempt here, I, I have to move Joanna over here. I need to move a bunch of people over there. I don't know which way I'm going to go because this whole area is choked off. I can't get to the boss even. I can't believe these guys are, are, are alive, both of them. Incredible work. Uh. <laughs> I only have, I only have six movement because they're both like severely injured. They, they, like honestly, that's another thing. Like yet another thing that you, that holds you back is like if they're hurt. If they're really hurt, they're worthless. 
So like on top of everything else. Oh, I, I, I don't know. This is just like no point in complaining about it, I guess. But like, you know what I mean? It's just like, it feels like there's just too, too many things in this game that are working against the player. I, I know that it's a, it's a deep game for sure. But like, I do think that the number of like things that the player has to worry about is just uh, on the, on the absurd. Um, I don't know what to do here. I can't even hit it. Oh, I can't even hit the wall. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't know. At least these guys don't have armor. He's about to die. I mean, I'll give him, I'll give them dodge. Maybe it's the only hope I've got really. Uh, who's got movement. So, uh, our friend over here is probably screwed. Like, I don't, I don't really foresee much hope here. I could try and make my way over there. Did I just poison myself? No, I don't think I did. I mean, if that was the case, I think I just like... Alt F4. <laughs> okay. We're out of... Why can't I move forward? Why can't I move? I've got two... Oh, I've got zero movement, actually. Never mind. Okay, well, we can give her more... Well, she has no mana left. None. So, like... Uh, that's kind of it. Like, she doesn't even have enough for one bee sting, and most of her damage comes from opportunism. I guess I could apply acid spray, and that counts as a debuff, and it does last for two turns. So, yeah, we still have stuff to do. I'm just going to get her over there. Oh, cool. She didn't make it. And now this boomer can, can reach her. Will it? I don't know. Okay, well, we'll see if the game is over. Oh, you killed him. Okay. I didn't realize that they could do that. Yeah, I mean, there's, uh, there's me not understanding how the boss works because I've never seen that before. Yeah, this is uh this is a hundred percent the end of the series. I'm not doing this again. What do you wait, what? That bottom one didn't die? Three health, huh? Three health. Oh god. Thing is, is I'm not even sure what I would do differently. Like, what what would I do? <laughs> how how could I contend against this? All crossbows. That's it. Just everyone has a crossbow. Everyone has isolation. No, that, that wouldn't do it either, actually. So you're dead too, right? Yep. Is anyone alive? Yes, you are. Okay, could you imagine if I somehow made it with this one dude left? What do you mean frog lads? How long have frog lads been here? Oh god, I'm, I'm, yeah, I mean, I, I don't understand how you, like, this game is great and all, but I don't understand how you, how you, you know, make something like this and, and think that, yeah, this is going to be fun. I'm sorry to be rude. Like, I'm being borderline rude at this point. I'm not just being borderline, I'm being rude about the game. 
and I don't care because I'm, I'm just kind of pissed off about it. Like, this is just a vicious amount of garbage to have to contend against. Wait, wait. I guess I, I guess that's it, right? I don't get to any, any more. If they, I don't know. <laughs> She's the only one alive. You know what? You know what? Hey, take that. All right, cool. She is finally dead over there. If only I could have applied poison to everyone. If I could have applied poison to literally every every single dryad as they appeared, maybe. Well. That's, uh, that's that, huh? All right, well, uh, if you've enjoyed this series, and yeah, it is over. I'm not trying that again. Um, you can let me know what I did badly. And I'm, you know, I am interested to know. Maybe I'm doing certain things wrong. Uh, it won't make a difference. I'm still done. But I, you know, it, worth, worth me knowing. And uh, I'd also like to know why don't you if anyone's gotten past Glenwald, what is next? Like how much harder does this game get? You know, let me know. And um, you know, for what it's worth, maybe you want to hit the like button. <laughs> Consider subscribing. I'll see you guys next time. Uh, I don't know what I'm playing next. We'll see. But uh, maybe let me know in the comments what you'd like to see me play next. Um, I, I'm open to that. Let's see. Uh, take it easy, everyone. Have a good day.